Fix Xerox printer not printing issue. For quick solutions. Method 1. Check paper type. Step 1. Pull out the paper tray and check whether there is paper in the tray. Step 2. Click on the Windows Start menu and type Control Panel in the search bar. Step 3. Open Control Panel Select View by Large Icons and click on Devices and Printers. Step 4. Right-click on your printer and select Printing Preferences. Step 5. Go to the Paper Quality tab in the Printing Preferences window. Step 6. In the Media field select the paper type ensure that it matches the paper that you are using and click OK. Method 2. Ensure that you've sent the print job to the right printer. Step 1. Type in Control Panel on the search bar. Step 2. Open Control Panel Select View by Large Icons and click on Devices and Printers. Step 3. Right-click on your printer and select See What's Printing. Step 4. Check your printer model on the top and then check your print jobs. Method 3. Delete print job from queue. Step 1. Type in the control panel in the search bar on your computer. Step 2. Open control panel select view by large icons and click on devices and printers. Step 3. Right click on your printer and select see what's printing. Step 4. Click on the printer tab. Step 5. Select Cancel All Documents and click on Yes. Method 4. Reinstall the printer driver. Step 1. Click on the Windows Start menu and open Settings. Step 2. Select Devices and then click on Printers and Scanners. Step 3. Scroll down and click on Print Server Properties. Step 4. Now go to the Drivers tab select your driver and click Remove. Step 5. In the following prompt select the Remove Driver Only option and click OK. Step 6. Open your browser and visit the official Xerox website and download your printer driver. Step 7. Once the download is finished click on the downloaded file and click on Extract All in the File Explorer. Step 8. Then click on the Extract button to start extracting the files. Step 9. Click the Windows Start menu and type Run in the search bar. Step 10. Open the Run dialog box type Control Panel and click OK. Step 11. In the Control Panel set View by to large icons and click on Devices and Printers. Step 12. Click Add a Printer and select the printer I want that wasn't listed on the prompt. Step 13. Select Add a Local Printer option and click on Next. Step 14. Select Create a New Port in the Choose a Printer Port page. Step 15. Select the type of port as standard TCP IP from the drop-down list and click Next. Step 16. In the following window enter your IP address and the port name will be automatically filled. Step 17. Uncheck the Query checkbox and click on Next. Step 18. While you wait for the windows to detect TCP IP port go to the File Explorer. Step 19. Navigate to your extracted files double click on the extracted files and open them. Step 20. Copy the file path from the top bar. Step 21. Go to the Add Printer window and select the Have Disk option on the Install the Printer Driver prompt. Step 22. Now paste the copied path in the copy manufacturer's file from field and click OK. Step 23. Select your printer model from the list and click Next. Step 24. In the Type A Printer Name screen change the printer name if you want then click Next. Step 25. The installation process will take some time. 
Step 26. Once the printer is successfully installed click on Finish. For more such help and information, visit us at www.printertales.com or call us at plus 1877 plus 4480548150.